and welcome back to the Dr. Mario Championship. My name is JB Henry. I am now joined in the booth by uh, Packy. Packy, how you doing, buddy? I'm doing beachy. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> Uh, all I can say about that game is Dr. Mario happened. That's all there Do is to it. Dr. Mario happened. That's a pretty pretty astute uh, summary of that uh, and what was a hell of a game. Uh, we've got our finals yeah. here. First timer in the finals, Floyd uh, versus uh, Dimwit. Uh, what, what are your thoughts going into this? This is going to be interesting. I think I heard this was Floyd's first trip to the finals, and he's going to be playing against someone who's been there many, many times. And Floyd, Floyd has been playing very, very well throughout this whole tournament. Uh, has had to go up against some very, very good competition. Uh, had you know got got a little bit of a scare in the first round, but uh, since then has not lost. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see how this goes. Uh, this is levels uh, thirteen to seventeen now. Uh, best of, uh, excuse me, best of five still. I'm just uh, getting a quick edit done here before we give you our lovely, lovely final screen. Uh, and remember, four championship points, and this is interesting. If Floyd uh, wins this, he'll, I believe, by uh, clear rate, will be in sole possession of fourth place. Uh, Dimwit obviously uh, keeping his number one spot uh, regardless of the outcome here, but a win here really distances him from the pack. No, no, no offense. One thing I will say about Floyd, he is third in the 0 through 20 speeder board on speedrun.com, and he is fourth on 0 through 10. What that tells me is he might be a better second half of the run player than the first half. So being in 13 through 17 may ultimately work in his favor. Well, we're going to find out here as our finals are about to get started. So get ready. I think this is going to be a really good one. We have a ready from Floyd. We have a ready from Dimwit. Let's rock. And we are off here. This is for the August championship winner. Floyd has two championship points. Well, both players left two championship points. They're playing for two more, uh, and that will determine seeding for the championships in December. Uh, and uh, while we've got these players going, let's not let's not. Uh, we I'd be remiss to not talk about our September qualifying while these two are uh, off to their start here on 13 it's going to start immediately at the end of this tournament go to september 10th with the uh, brackets happening immediately uh the weekend after uh so we can accommodate for time for the uh, columbus championships uh later on in september lloyd playing down the middle right now he's got a funnel of yellow to to deal with right now Hopefully the RNG gives him what he needs. But RNG is a fickle mistress, as I learned the hard way. <laughs> We've got uh, a big lead also for Dimwit right now. He's really opened it up, but uh, Floyd's starting to make an attack here. Uh, it is a 16 virus lead as Floyd just dropping a big uh, pile of garbage down. Uh, he's going to drop these blues down as well and clear out his board. He has that double blue for that uh, horizontal clear, but Packy, he really needs yellows right now. Yeah, he needs yellow that he's just not getting them. And when you get them, don't waste them. Now he's getting a double yellow run. Perfect. Now I can start getting through, and there's the double blue at the end. And he's going to bracket clear this garbage off of the center of his board, uh, and he's going to get that double up in column number two. He's really just been having trouble keeping that top line flat uh, as Packy, or excuse me, Dimwit already out at <laughs> a, a minute 42. It's nice to know you're thinking about me. <laughs> uh, very double-friendly board from Dimwit if he could start uh, whittling this 14 down. Uh, remember, 13 to 17. 17 is when the virus is stacked to their absolute maximum on the board. Uh, really can uh, top outs are definitely a factor at that point. We've seen them happen in these finals. Uh, it's just one one misplay early on, and uh, you're stuck. I want to say Dimwit got out out of level thirteen in what a minute and fifty seconds. Anytime right about. you get out, anytime you get out of one of the teens in less than two minutes is phenomenal. Absolutely. 
Uh, Floyd struggling to get out of 13 right now. Uh, has just a big cluster of uh, viruses in that lower right corner uh, and is ho holding out for uh, that exact pill. Uh, and uh, he is going to be down to five viruses here. Uh, not quite free and clear. Needs to get that last uh, blue accessed, and he does. Uh, and he's going oh, to nice turn L. it into a uh, nice and drop then a cross. T. Oh, man. Dimwit's on fire right now. Dimwit's going to get a nice zero drop clear on those reds. And uh, oh, I see what he's... I think he's going to go for the drop here. Wait for that red blue. Doesn't look like he's going to Oh, he's going to take it. those yellows first. I didn't see that for a second. Floyd was out There's at right around three minutes, which is a painful time. Um, yeah. Big, oh, but big, that big cross. Very nice. But uh, it is free and clear for Dimwit. Uh, he just needs one red, one yellow. There's the yellow. There's the red. He'll be out at a 3.34. Man, this pace right now. Whew. He is absolutely torching this run so far. And players are players are looking optimally for a time in the 13-minute range, although uh, our hot times range from 12.49 uh, to 11.41. Uh, it's mostly Frank, Dimwit, and Packy on that hot time board. Uh, and again, when this is your first time in the finals, you're not really used to playing uh, these higher levels at, at a speed uh, where you're playing them normally, uh, you know, 6 to 9, 8 to 11. So this is definitely a new challenge for Floyd, and I know he's probably adjusting. True as that is, Floyd, ha Floyd is really, really good with the 0 through 20s, so... It's not that unfamiliar territory to him, but it's a different story when you're racing against someone. Nine viruses to go here as uh, Floyd looking to get out of uh, 14 and get some momentum going. Uh, he's also got that red virus uh, in his lower right corner he needs to access. Uh, but he needs to do it by getting rid of that blue in eight. Looks like he's going to get a double. Maybe he's going to go for that double clear. Good call there. He's down to three viruses as uh, we cross the five-minute mark. After a really rough start to this run, Floyd is having a really good 14. I think that's a two-minute 14. That's awesome. Very good 14, uh, but he is down by quite a bit, uh, almost 40 viruses at this point. Uh, he's going to have to go to town here, maybe hope for some mistakes on Dimwit's side, uh, but Dimwit firmly in control here in this first game. Well, the thing about falling behind early is that you've got plenty of time to catch up. You'd rather fall behind early, like this early than late. So yeah. let's see if he can start shipping away at that lead, which is currently 37 viruses. Then we're taking that horizontal smart move. No more yellow on the board, but that tuck that tuck will get rid of some reds. And I think maybe he might be eyeballing going for that L. Uh, we'll see what happens here, especially with that double. No, he's oh uh, no, nope, can't get it now. Can't get that, so he's gonna have to get these uh, all vertically, the old-fashioned way. Yeah, that's what makes horizontals kind of tricky because everything underneath shifts down a row, and if you were set setting up other horizontals, it messes everything up. And uh, Dim went out at a 624, uh, two levels to go here. And you see these levels stacking higher, and there's less air bubbles, uh, you know, between these viruses. A quick, nice, quick quad nice drop. Nice double there. horizontal right there. Love it. And those, those are the combos you have to look for when you're in these, you know, high teen levels. It's just so, so difficult to really get anything going. Your main goal is to just open up some space so you can start going to work. Dimwit chooses not to take the horizontal. I'm, I imagine he's doing that because he wants to preserve the double verticals further down the board. He got himself a fat log. It's the fat log. Now he can take those verticals. Very nice. Floyd, meanwhile, uh, big problems here. He's exclusively yellow-red. And uh, mm -hmm. not really getting anything to help him out of that situation. 
Uh, looks like he's going to start addressing that left side, getting that nice and clear. Uh, maybe you want to consider some vertical setup. No, it looks like he's got that horizontal setup that he was seeking. Uh, he's got, he can take that horizontal double yellow whenever he wants. He decides to do it now. Eight viruses to go. Uh, Dinwood struggling a bit here on 16. The board looks a little, little scattered. A little bit of polka dot action going on. Okay, I see what he's doing. Clean up with the whole, clean up with the horizontals. Minimize your drop time. And Floyd now free and clear. He's got the horizontal. He's got the vertical. Uh, should have should have played the blue red first. I think he knows that. You can see the little tip there, the shake. All right, head. now he's done. What's going to go underneath and take that? Very nice. Floyd, blue please. There it is. Out at eight seventeen. Oh man. But it is. Let's a, go, Floyd. Again, it is a forty three virus difference between these two. Is uh, Floyd just not able to get anything going here? Uh, you've and there's a huge blue funnel going on right from the get go. It's been the unstoppable force versus the immovable object here uh, in this yes. final. Uh, 55 viruses to go for Floyd. Is he starting to get something going here? But again, just not at. He's, this top line is two colors, and RNG keeps giving him the color he doesn't need. Yeah. When that happens, what all you all you can really do is just try to expose other colors on your board. Try to get something going. A good good uh, cross drop there across the board. Uh, and Dimwit, oh my goodness, oh, look Dimwit at this RNG. Perfect. And at the end of this is going to be a yellow. And he's out at 913. He's got one level to go. Absolute brilliant run net by Dimwit as well. Uh, when Dimwit gets going, he's hard to stop. Yeah, he. if I'm Dimwit right now, I'm sniffing sub 12. Perfect horizontal clear. We got Ook the Librarian uh, dropping some knowledge on our uh, new new viewers. Thanks for watching us. If you're new, we love having new folks here. We've got uh, 54 viruses to go on 17. the The other noticeable difference is Floyd is playing medium while Dimwit is playing high speed. Uh, I know yes. Floyd is a big proponent of uh, medium speed, and a lot a lot of players are just for uh, ease of control. And I know Packy, you're you know you're a heavy dedicate heavily dedicated uh high high speed player uh what what are you what do you feel is better on high speed well if you have moments of hesitation on high speed the pills are going to drop fast are going to drop faster than they would at medium speed and when you're maneuvering pills to the sides it helps the pills drop faster however i do see merits of playing on medium speed people like an Ari and Frank play on medium speed because with slower fall time you actually have more time to maneuver your pills if you're trying to do like pill swims or something like that so it's not it's not like it's not without its merits and uh Floyd got into 17 right at around 10 minutes 45 seconds and uh, you could see him getting some really rough RNG to start on this one, too. He's got a little straggler stacked up a little higher than I think he'd like. Uh, he's going to get this Ooh. to drop, but uh, it is an, an almost an inevitability right now for Dimwit here. He's down to his final 14. But uh, if yeah, I'm... Unless, unless Dr. Mario started starts inventing green pills, I don't... This is probably not going to change. <laughs> <laughs> But Dimwit lining up those horizontals. He's very well set up to deal with those reds at the bottom. And he's got, uh, he had a horizontal blue if he wanted it. I think he elected not to do it. Uh, maybe take a double horizontal. No, he's just going to go all no, in. No, he's going to do it vertical. And uh, if he cleans up those two blue segments in the middle, he can then just drop a red fragment down into the bottom horizontal row. See, there, there it is. Great play there. He's down to his final virus. Uh, Floyd down oh, to 36, man. but at a 12.04, Dimwit <laughs> will take game number one of this championship. 12.04, that is an outstanding time. 12.04 is definitely something you're looking at, that 12-minute range. Uh, it'll be one to nothing. 
Uh, we'll see if Floyd can come back from that, though. It's his, uh, only his second game loss of the tournament. He has been playing fantastically throughout. That 12.04 is the fourth fastest time in the finals. Fourth fastest in the finals, huh? Yes. That is... Yeah, that's absolutely correct. So, uh, Dimwit now holds uh, almost... Uh, he holds 60% of those top five times. Five of the top seven times, in fact. Just absolute monster out there. Uh, we're ready for our second game. I'm Floyd. Just shake it off. There's still a lot of Dr. Mario to be played. And it's almost when you're in this final situation. I mean, I've not gotten here, but I, I've I've been to the semifinals once. Uh, it's definitely you know just you get that first loss out of the way. Uh, you know, just try to get your get your feet going. Uh, get your sea legs in this uh, level stack and uh, just try to try to improve on the next run. And we're already seeing that from Floyd as he's got some really good, a really strong start here on 13. Absolutely. I like what he's doing. His top line is mostly flat. It's a little bit of a color mix up going on, but that inevitably happens at some point in these later levels. He's Floyd, handling it pretty well. He is definitely trying to keep things clean, trying to just suss out uh you know one pill clear is just to open up more space on his board i like this clear here uh really just trying to stay efficient uh he is starting to run it out of blue uh but it looks like he can clear uh this yellow in six and still have a little bit of access uh meanwhile dimwit is uh cruising dimwit is torching 13 again he is just destroying this level today Although Dimwick gets a red-blue, can't really do much with that. And you saw the hesitation. I uh, had to yeah. think about that. Also, he's a little bit locked on red. Uh, that double red, I'm sure he would have loved to have rather used in row one uh, to get that horizontal. But uh, it wasn't to be. as He's down to seven. But here comes Floyd. Floyd's got a really good setup going here. A lot of doubles that he can play with uh, as he's down yep. at 14 viruses. He could really mount a comeback here uh, and has a very clean board. I love this board down to 12. And he's going to set up here for uh, some doubles. Yes, he is. He's down to 10. He's now down to 9. Dimwit down to 3, but he's got to make some clears to get to everything here. Floyd's got 7 viruses. And again, and just. A he needs to stop getting board. blues, though. <laughs> yeah, this blue is. Blue surge is <sighs> not the time. And uh, realize. A little bit of hesitation. That, that was Dimwit natural. Is out hesitation. Of the level. Oh, go ahead. Yeah. It, it's it's it, that that hesitation is just trying to figure out what's the most optimal play that makes you require the le the least amount of reds. And this I've is been a, there. This is a three virus game right now. As uh, Floyd also into fourteen, these players just a few seconds apart. And you see Floyd with a great RNG setup here, uh, getting some great uh, setups to get some clears, uh, uh, getting some problems here with this exclusively blue top line, uh, but making the best of the situation here. And uh, again, a, really, really like what he's doing. There's a lack of access to yellow, which means it's a good idea to attack that blue in the center. And he'll take it and expose some yellow so that he can actually use yellow pills. And, and Dimwit's board is split badly right now. Uh, just and there's an... Oh, I thought he was going to take the L there. Uh, the L clear. That is not the L as in a loss, by the way. Uh, and if that if Floyd does win, uh, then what that is Packy's fault and not mine. Uh, across there from uh, Floyd puts him at 35. He's tied up. He's got that exclusively red top line now. Really needs to start working on that, and he does. Uh, ooh, and that triple blue clear. Nice tuck there. Uh, that's going to put him under 30. It is a slight lead for Floyd, and we're going to see a double clear there. No blue right now, though, for Floyd as uh, he's trying to make things work on 14. Bracket clears the blues. Good move. There's a big yellow funnel coming up. Dimwit at 19, Floyd at 21, and Floyd has a good setup here on that left side. That right side's starting to become a spire. We're seeing him starting to address that. It's a seven virus lead now for Dimwit as he is nice and clear, almost free and clear 
uh, really just needs to get some more out of that right hand corner and it looks like he'll get that to drop down to six viruses and uh, 16 for Floyd as he's needing yellow help desperately. Yeah, and he's not really getting much of it. That'll set up the horizontal clear on the blue once he gets another piece of yellow, but he needs a lot more than he's getting. Good drop cross there to get something going, and now you see him just chip away at doubles. He's got an opportunity for that double red. He is going to take it, and I do like this because this sets up blue on that bottom row as well. Great vision by Floyd as he's down to his seven viruses, but... Uh, Dimwood already working on 15 down to 58 viruses, but I'm looking at Dimwood's board and he's going to run out of red eventually, and it looks like he has. Oh yeah, look at that yellow and blue board. Smart clear by Floyd, getting full access to that yellow in column 8. 48 viruses to go here for Dimwit as Floyd trying to get out of 14, trying to keep this competitive. He'll be out there at 5 go. minutes flat. It is a almost 20 virus difference between these two players, and it's about to be more as uh, Dimwit with a couple of big clears, and he is going to get that tuck triple down to 38. Floyd looking to set up a uh, horizontal red, and uh, he would optimally love a red-blue to do it with. Yes, a red blue or a double red works as well, honestly. And he just takes it at that point because he's tired of waiting for the pill. And he's going to get a clean drop cross nicely. anyway. Beautiful cleanup. Bangs out a couple more horizontals. I like it. He's not that far behind. He's making a very good run of this right now. You know, we've seen him clear. Uh, you make a clear every uh, few pills here. Uh, 36 to 18. Log. Beautiful fat log to get, uh, I believe, five viruses off the board. Great play there by Floyd. He's needing some uh, uh, blue help. He's going to get it in the form of that drill and uh, now uh, has a pretty clean board. Uh, hoping for some yellow access is going to get it down to 26, 26 to 7. Looking at Dimwit's board, though, it's very, very clean. Uh, really, the only big problem is that left side, which is going to get cleared in three pills. So uh, some hope summoned for Dimwit as he's down to his final three with that double clear down to one. And, uh, and you can eat off that board. Out at 626, Dimwit just steaming through the ends of these uh, boards here. Uh, Floyd's just getting stuck with one color so often and it's just hamstringing them yeah and, and sometimes sometimes it's the best you can do i mean it's it's the most frustrating thing about this version of dr mario but sometimes it's all you can do and sometimes you just gotta grin and bear it and move on but we see Floyd setting up for something nice here. He's going to get this double, and he's also now set himself up for that blue uh, in row one. I really like that play as uh, he's got that horizontal access, uh, and he'll get and it. So, that, yeah. Yeah. And once that drops down a row, he has full access to that red virus, so it will be no problem trying to clear this thing. Meanwhile, Dimwit has a very healthy board state right now. Uh, Floyd out at a 723, uh, but it is still about a 28 virus advantage for Dimwit here in the second game. Dimwit's eyeballing that red horizontal. If he gets a couple more red blues, it's going to be a T. He just takes the horizontal. <laughs> Good horizontal there by Dimwit, down to 27. Uh, he's got that blue straggler, and uh, maybe we'll take care of it with a blue-yellow. Doesn't look like it as uh, he's at 24. 57 for Floyd. Look at this drop tee, though. Beautiful play by Floyd. He's got that red garbage. It's not that big of a deal, though. He's got some solutions, and uh, we're seeing one there, that drop clear. Uh, he's down to 51, and now he's going to drill down. And uh, pretty good board reset here as uh, it's 49 uh, now 47 for Floyd, and I like this combo as nice, well. Big nice combo. combo by Floyd. A couple dozen viruses down right now. It's not insurmountable, but he is starting to run out of time a little bit. Well, we're really seeing some efficient clears here. Uh, you know, he's really chipping away at this, and we're seeing Dimwit a uh, bit of a struggle here on the end of his 16. Uh, Floyd's trying to take advantage of that here, and Floyd playing an incredibly clean 16 right now. Uh, trying to keep this competitive as uh, it is about nine minutes here into the second game. Floyd goes with the drop combo to clear out column three. 
Some reds would be great to start cleaning up the right side. Almost missed dropped right there. I did like that recovery, though. Yes. And uh, Dim went out at about 9-10. He's into 17 already. 72 viruses uh, between him and going up two games to none. Dim went being patient, not forcing the drop there, and just waiting for the tuck to happen. And you really got to do that when you're this high up, because one slip and you're toast. But we're seeing Floyd absolutely torch the 16. This is uh, a fantastic 16 run. I would go back and retime this because uh, he's really uh, put together a great run here on this 16. He just needs uh, one half of each pill. There's the red. There's the blue. Out at 957. He's still down, but uh, really making this competitive as he's only down by 22. Slowly but surely closing the gap. Gets rid of all that yellow over there and has a nice varied top line that he can work with. He's just been very, very clean throughout this whole run. Uh, as Now he's starting to get yellows. Not the greatest option for him, but he's uh, doing his best here trying to get something going. Uh, and this is a smart play. He's going to definitely tuck that uh, double red over to that top one. You don't want to leave those top viruses exposed for too long on these higher levels. Boyd keeping it clean and flat. I like the way he's handling 17 thus far. It's he's... still a 22 virus gap because Dimwood is also playing every bit as clean. But uh, Floyd having a very strong uh, second half of this second game. Uh, as we're just seeing him just be an absolute beast and gets that tuck triple nice. in that very, very small gap. Uh, it's 32 to 25 right now, Packy. It's starting to oh, become a game. Man, it's tightening up like crazy right now. And that's going to eliminate four more and close it to four. It's a three virus game, folks. Floyd could come right oh, back here and make boy. this a one to one game. Let's take a look here and see what he does. He's going to get three more. He's down to 19. He could take the lead here, folks. Good boards for both players. Uh, Dimwit stuck there a little bit on his left side. It is 16 to 17. Floyd has taken the lead. Floyd, has, Floyd oh, is getting man. a nice, convenient double surge comeback. right now. 14 to 14. Dimwit trying to boom, stave boom. Floyd off. Currently 13. Now it's... 9 to 10, very, very close between these two players. Dimwit's got to drill down. That second's going to cost him, but he's going to get a one drop there. He's down to six. It's six to five. It's anybody's game here. It's a bit cleaner of a board now for Dimwit. He just needs the two yellows. Oh, Who's going to get this? It's so close. It is now down to one. Oh, and with that Dimwit's double yellow, Dimwit's going to take it at a 12 14. Wow. Oh. Wow. Floyd was so close to evening this up, but it is two to nothing, Dimwit, and you can see the relief on Dimwit's face. A nine second, or excuse me, an eleven second difference between our two players, and Floyd had taken the lead at one point. Phenomenal game too, but it is in Dimwit's favor as he is one win away from another championship. To give an idea of how well that was played. Dimwit's time will now be ranked eighth on the hot times list, and Floyd's will now be tied for tenth. I want to eleventh. Dimwit's trying to top out, and it's giving him all reds and down the middle. Floyd says, GG, that's about the best I've got. I don't think so. I think we're going to see another great run here. But Dimwit can put this away with one more win. This may be 2 nothing, but it doesn't feel like 2 nothing. It really doesn't. Here we go. We're starting our third game here. Dimwit wins this. He is the August champion. Uh, if Floyd wins this, we play a game four. Very, very close game between these two. 
as we get started here. Good starts from both players. Not a lot of yellow access for Dimwit. This might be Floyd's opportunity. Not a lot of yellow access for Floyd either, however. Great combo by Dimwit. And Dimwit starting to open up that board. Really starting to make a well in column 8. Again, no yellow access for Dimwit, but he's got that straggler down. So a relatively even top line, and I like this decision. Uh, split that yellow down the middle and make something happen. Uh, 35 to 39, it's a slight lead for Dimwit as uh, Floyd's struggling. Not a lot of blue access for him, Packy. No, but there were a couple of horizontal opportunities on the right hand or the left hand side. It looks like he's not going to take the yellows, but he did take the reds earlier. But now he needs red access. 32 viruses to go. Now 31. Now 29 for Floyd as he's Looks trying like to he set will. up a cross. Looks like he will take that yellow horizontal after all as soon as it gives him what he needs. And there it and is. Turn that into a combo. Beautiful combo. He's down to 24. But Dimwit uh, in the lead right now by five viruses. Dimwit needs uh, red help desperately. It looks like he's going to get a little bit here. Uh, he's going to tuck that yellow double in horizontally, 16 to 24 here. Uh, and the, the red help is a little bit more exacerbated by that bit of garbage in the middle of Dimwit's board. Yeah, having a having having two segments of viruses and then a, and then a spire of pills splitting them can lead to some pretty unpleasant situations. Floyd right now had the lead for a second, but then went, went just back to being wildly efficient. Uh, down to four viruses. Floyd is going to get into single digits, though, but that, that, right, that right corner uh, looks to be a problem spot for Floyd. Yeah, he cleared out some of the garbage horizontally, which gives him a few more options to play with. And but Dimwit, Dimwit is out at 211. Sorry. <laughs> Floyd just needs some blue. And Floyd is looking to be out here relatively soon. That double blue is what he needed out at a 237. Uh, he's got nice. some work to do as uh, Dimwit's already up by uh, 11 viruses. It looks like Dimwit is setting up for a blue horizontal. If he gets a blue yellow, that will just work fine. Uh, the game does not want to give it to him. Yeah, that leaves him to figure out what he's going to do with his board in the meantime while he's waiting for it. Here it comes. Big combo here. Instantly cleans the board up. He was running out of options, though. He's down to 30 viruses. Floyd, a bit of a split, has a bit of an island in the middle of his board. Uh, looks like he might be trying to drop down to do a uh, horiz double horizontal. Looks like that's exactly what he's trying to do. Looks like he might be giving up on it. It does look like he's done that, uh, and he's going to clear out that uh, straggler of a couple of yellows uh, and then do a bracket clear to get set up. Uh, he's not really getting favorable RNG. He's already down to 28, but uh, Dimwit cruising through uh, at 13. Uh, you know, you, you have to wonder if Floyd might be exhausted. Uh, you know, these, these five game sets, as you know more than probably anybody here, they take a lot out of you. They do. I was drenched in sweat after game five was over. <laughs> <laughs> Four viruses to go here for Dimwit. Dimwit maintaining a great pace right now. Two to go. Now down to his last one, needing that final red. But uh, Floyd's not too far behind. He's got ten viruses. He just needs a good red burst. But at 422, uh, Dimwit is now at the midpoint. Lloyd's got a couple of horizontals set up. Looks like he's taken one of them. Okay. Looks like he's going to do it the old-fashioned way. Nice and easy. Doesn't Don't need anything too fancy. Floyd will yep. be out at a 448. That's an improvement over 13. It That's is, for sure. It is a nine-virus advantage right now uh, for Dimwit, as both players on 15. And as soon as you complete the sentence, the gap is down to two. But 
now we're having a bit of a problem. That blue-yellow, not a great pill combination for uh, Floyd, really needs to open up that left side of the board. Uh, and he continues he might, to get that uh, blue-yellow. He might have been thinking horizontal there, but the thing is, the most friendly ho pieces you could get for that to that end were double reds, and it's a little difficult to depend on doubles. And uh, despite that, it's uh, still just a handful of viruses between our two players, as Dimwit's also been struggling. Uh, hasn't really been able to maintain a flat top line, but look at that drop. Great combo, uh, down to 33. Uh, just absolutely smooth as silk. That board has been busted open, but Dimwit doesn't have a lot of red access right now. However, I really like that move by Dimwit right there, setting up the horizontal and setting up the next few clears with that move right there. Getting a little bit of red access, but he only has one really readily access accessible red uh, as row one is essentially buried right now. Uh, meanwhile, Floyd has uh, just a bit of a cluster in the middle of his board here, really looking for some red-yellow help. Looks like he's starting to get it. Uh, as he is at 24 viruses. It is a 10 virus lead for Dimwit. Is Dimwit uh, almost exclusively blue? There's a giant cluster of red for Floyd to worry about right now. Very nice hell clear right there. It's 14 to Man, 7 this right a, now. This one's a close one. Floyd see. is out of red. Sorry. And so is so is Dimwit. Dimwit needs uh, a blue, uh, two blues and a yellow. He's going to get and the nice. yellow, but he's going to be forced to have to drop combo potentially. Uh, no, he's not. He's going to get a no, double blue. No, he is not. Uh, out at a 7.16. Floyd not too far behind. Floyd is going to be out at a 7.25, so very, very close here Ooh. going into the penultimate level. And you know this is intense when our chat is speechless as what as to what's going on right now. <laughs> there has not been a peep in chat this entire second game. Uh, so you know that they are on uh, pins and needles as well. Uh, 56 viruses to go for Floyd. 51 for Dimwit. Uh, Dimwit trying to maintain a diverse top line. A lot of doubles on Floyd's board, especially the further down you go. Uh, doubles are rampant on mostly on the left side of Dimwit's board, but they are uh, almost exclusively in columns one to three. Floyd, those those blue yellows are difficult to accommodate at this point, but. As soon as he can knock down that, those spires and even out his stack, he'll be gold. Floyd in the lead right now just by a handful of viruses. It's now a six-virus lead for Floyd. Floyd's starting to go to town here. Uh, 31 viruses to go now to 36 for Dimwit. Dimwit had a bit of a misplay. He's got to work around it. Uh, we'll see what he can do here. But right now, Floyd trying to force a game four. Does not want to get swept in his first finals appearance. But here comes Dimwit with a big combo, and suddenly it is a uh, one-virus game in favor of Floyd. And so far, so good on level 16. Floyd's got a, Floyd may have a horizontal in his future on the right-hand side. And he's got a left-hand side horizontal in his immediate future. It's currently 15 to 11, Floyd. Floyd's big problem, though, is that left side, Packy. He's really got to start to address it. He needs that yellow to do it. Uh, and it looks like he's electing to get the yellow out of column two first so he can start making moves. Yeah, you do that because if you don't have a double yellow, then it really doesn't accommodate, accommodate that extra yellow vi virus that's just dangling there. Big combo for Dimwit to open his board up. He's suddenly down to eight and suddenly has a very, very clean board. And we're about to see a drop combo here. He's out of red, needs a lot of yellow help, especially to get that combo along the bottom. But Floyd is going to be out first. He's going to get into 17 and he is going to hopefully do it. Uh, now at a 9.45, uh, and uh, Dimwit a little bit behind here. We'll see how Dimwit gets out here. Uh, it looks no like 5, 6, Floyd. 7, 8. Looks to be about a 10-second, 11-second difference between our players here. That's just a handful of viruses. I'm not liking Floyd 17. There is a 
big well in four and five. Ooh, that's an interesting placement for Dimwit there. Well, it's a, but he can knock that out with a quick horizontal. Perfect. And he's cleaned it right back up. Uh, Floyd is Floyd's going to have to manage this top line in a really challenging way because of that well that's in uh, four and five. Uh, ooh, we're going to get a five here pack a here. Big, big clear. Uh, but Dimwit has taken the lead back. It is 51 to 52. Uh, Floyd uh, managing to... Floyd really just, I think, was focusing mm -hmm. on getting that top line down even, and I think that was the smart play. Don't go too too aggressive on clears, uh, and it is definitely helping him here. Uh, but now, uh, taking a look at Dimwit's board, Dimwit's really cleared out that left side down to 37 viruses, so Floyd's really got to go to work here, and he's red heavy on that top line. Yeah, there's, there's a whole lot of red he's got to deal with, but he's getting some red to help him out. There's no yellow access, though, right now. But it is very, very close right now. And a good play here by Dimwit. Good combo. That's going to put him down to 25, and he's going to take that easy clear along the bottom down to 23. Uh, Floyd really needing uh, to get out of this blue and yellow or blue and red jam he's been in. Uh, it is a five virus game, and Floyd's about to take four more off. It is 21 to 18. Big efficient clears now for both players. It's a very challenging for Dimwit as he's got to focus that right side. Floyd has the better top line, the better board health, but Dimwit has the lead. It is 16 to 15 here. Now Floyd taking the lead down to 13, 13 to 13 between these two players who is going to take oh, this home boy. are we going to have a fourth game or is Dimwit going to pull this out it is currently 12 to 11 as uh Dimwit looking to have to get creative here uh but doing a great job down to 11 but floyd in single digits first at nine here as we cross the 12 minute mark and a horizontal clear into another horizontal clear into another horizontal clear by Dimwit puts him down to seven. Who's going to get this? That double red huge for Dimwit. He is going to be down to five. It's gonna have. It's gonna come down to that yellow virus, I think, in oh. that lower corner. He's got that cleared out. It's four oh, to Floyd two right now. But there. Floyd going to get Floyd's the RNG get and he's going to get it in twelve thirty three and twelve thirty four for Dimwit. Floyd taking game three, keeping his hopes alive. Five. What a finish. Wow. By the way, those two are also top 20 times for the oh, finals. Oh, these two just absolutely. These two are, the, are at the top of their game right now. Wow. Amazing by Ooh. Floyd. And we lost Floyd's game feed. There it is. All right. I know how it feels, Dimwit. One heck of a game. Great job by Floyd. Pull that one out. All right. We have another match on the way. We've got a ready from Floyd. We've got a ready from Dimwit. And both players ready. We're going to get started here on game four. Looks to be about a six second difference between our players. As Dimwit already going to town here. Big clear is already down to 51. Looking to really uh, take this one home. Uh, he, he had that win in the grasp of his hands and couldn't quite put it away. Uh, Floyd at 46. Floyd trying to keep this competitive. Floyd wants a game five. Floyd wants that championship. He wants to join. He's going to get that horizontal. Very nice. Whew. But then it's the double yellow flurry. And here it comes Dimwit. Going to get that drop cross down to 34, but Floyd maintaining just an ever so slight lead. 33, now 32 for Dimwit. Dimwit's going to have to start working on that left side, and he is. 29 to go, now 28. These players trading leads here early in 13, just jabs and body blows back and forth. Those double yellows will help him clean out those spires efficiently. Not much use for red on Dimwit's side at the moment. 
And now not much use for Blue either. As he's getting a little hung up here, Floyd taking advantage of that. Uh, down to 15 viruses. Uh, limited access to yellow. He's doing it the best he can. He's going to get a nice triple clear there, and he is down to 11. It looks like he's going to hit single digits first, and he will with this one pill, com one drop combo. Then another combo down to seven. Great play here by Floyd. Floyd going for that horizontal tuck, then going to tuck in another vertical. Uh, is just going to try to hold out, get access to that red. He will have access to that red. Going to get a double tuck there. Uh, nine viruses to go here for Dimwit as uh, he is looking to uh, get something going here. Now down to five. One virus to go, though, for Floyd, and he is going to be out at 203. He is going to be in the lead going into 14. That was a really good 13. And Dimwit will, will be just a little bit behind here at a 225. So uh, still a close game here. It's a seven virus advantage for Floyd as both players in 14. Floyd forced a black bracket clear as he doesn't have any yellow to work with until now. Opens that one up in column one. Uh, meanwhile, Dimwit looking to get fancy here. He's going to get another drop clear, keeping that board nice and clean. It's something he's so good at, playing from underneath. Uh, he's down to 49, trying to get back into this lead, but Packy, he also does not have access to yellow, and that's a misplay on that uh, garbage drop. Lloyd now leading by a dozen. So far, so good on his side. Relatively clean. Bracket clearing pretty efficiently. And a horizontal by Dimwit puts him at 42. But uh, Floyd just absolutely going at it here. Just pressing down, getting some one pill clears. Just big confidence booster here uh, as he just took that win away from Dimwit. But we, we've, double yellow. we've yep. seen Dimwit really pull out some big plays, though, and come back. So uh, no lead is safe. Don't he, I know it. <laughs> as he gets that quad L, it is currently a five virus game. So Dimwit pulling back in here. Uh, Dimwit needs to start addressing that right side. It looks like he will. Is going to get a double yellow surge. Elects to not go for that triple horizontal. Uh, it was very cleanly presented to him, and he decided to not go for it. Uh, it is Floyd with a three virus lead here. His big problems that spire in column two as he gets that double blue to clear it out. And big combo here puts him at single big digits. Big horizontal. Love it. Four viruses to go here. Looking for the perfect pill right there for that Floyd. Is, He's going to combo right out at a 428. Uh, Dimwit, 10 viruses behind here. But we're oh, about to see a combo. big combo from Dimwit. I imagine what Dimwit's trying to do is set up that horizontal for those reds and was trying to set up a horizontal for the yellow, but that one red fragment throws it all off. And now he's going to have to uh, unbury that uh, yellow in some fashion. It looks like he's going to just do it uh, with a drop combo here. He'll be out uh, just north of five minutes at a 509. Floyd uh, right now has a lead of 14 viruses as we go into the midpoint. Boyd is getting kind of hemmed in with the color selection of these pills, but that double red is going to be a huge help. 40 viruses to go to 57. Dimwit is no blue at all. Uh, that's going to be really rough here, not even with uh, that outpouring of a clear on that left side. Uh, looks like he's just trying to get some sort of access to blue, uh, try to open this board up. He's going to go for that left side. Uh, probably the right call here, especially as he oh, gets that triple good. clear, trying to catch up to Floyd. Floyd with uh, 32 viruses to go, and everything really clustered, uh, which means every uh, every decision here is very, very critical when they're clustered like that. We can take care of that right column with that double yellow so he doesn't have to deal with any drop time on that stray virus.
Looks like he might be thinking about setting up. Um, maybe I, I thought maybe he was trying to go for a blue horizontal between columns one and five, but that was not the case. Dimwit really struggling here through. He's going to get this L to drop, but uh, right now Floyd firmly in the driver's seat here. He's looking to force a game five. This rate he just might. He's got an 18 virus lead. He's been slowly building that lead over the course of time. Floyd needing reds and blues in mass quantity right now. Yeah, that stack over on that right side, very, very precarious here. He's going to get a, a couple of clears, though, consecutively. Three pills in a row, four pills in a row, and he's cleared something. You love seeing those clear streaks as uh, it is uh, five to go. Now three to go for Floyd. Floyd ready to force this game five. And just needs that last pill, and he'll be at 16 first at a 721. And Dimwit just cannot get anything going here, Packy. Yeah, RNG, it's it's rough, but he's got he's got if if he can cut that horizontal, there it is. He gets a couple of clears out of that. That helps him clean up a bunch of garbage. He might be trying to clear horizontally that line of yellows right there and set everything else up. That's exactly what it's look like. It's looking like he's trying to do here. That's gonna take care of the red horizontal and now he's just got to deal with a small column of viruses on the left-hand side. Just a small traffic light, but it looks like he's got it under control here. That double red, huge. Yep. Uh, can clear that any way he wants. Uh, Dimwit going to be out at an 8.15, but uh, Floyd making a big lead here right now. It is a 23 virus lead for the one seed. Floyd looking really good in this game. Zero drop time on that clear. I like what he's doing. A double red could give him a T clear right now. Oh, big, perfect. Big T right now. It is a 20 virus advantage as Dimwit looking to get out of here. He's going to get a big set of cons uh, chain clears as uh, he gets uh, a bunch of viruses out. He's down to 37, and I like that combo, putting him down to 35, trying to keep the pressure on Floyd. Yeah, Dimwit can afford to lose this game, but Floyd cannot. So the pressure is still on Floyd. And if I'm Dimwit, I've probably left that red virus up in eight uh, to be cleared when it, when I can, preferably with a double. But uh, it's either going to be a double or it's going to be the last virus I clear. Absolutely. Clear it at your leisure only when it's convenient. So that is accessible on high speed, but only just. And Looks like he couldn't get that one quite over. The speed might be yeah. a little too high to do that right now. Oh, but look at this beautiful combo in those two columns. Just seesawed it right back. Uh, he's down to 15, but Floyd right now down to three. Uh, he'll get into 17 first, and it looks like Floyd might, might go horizontal here. That seems to be the play as he yep. is going to get into 16 just south of 10 minutes at a 9.58. Uh, but Very nice. uh, now we're starting to see Dimwit get into this here. Uh, Dimwit needing uh, just a few reds. And we're probably going to see Dimwit uh, das over uh, for that last one. If you want to, I, I think you could. Pro oh, no. A big misdrop Ooh. for Dimwit. That's uncharacteristic. And that's going to give Floyd a little more time to deal with this bad top line he was dealt at the start. Manages to dash that pill over and get I clear see that what, virus. I think Dimwit was realizing maybe Whew. he couldn't dash that over. So, uh, but he is going to get out at 10:43. Uh, it is 59 viruses to go for Floyd to 72. So it's just 13 viruses as Floyd. You were saying, Packy, off to a very rough start here on 17. Yeah, his top line was very uniform in terms of color, and it really didn't give him much to work with from the start. That missed drop from Dimwit bought him some time, but let's see if it's going to be enough because now it's a, only a dozen viruses separating the pl each player. 
and Dimwit's got a pretty good diverse top line right now. It's about to be a little red heavy, uh, but he opens up some blues as well. Oh, check uh, out that tuck. Great tuck there. 38 viruses to go for Floyd, 51 for Dimwit, but he's starting to uh, get back into this now. 44 to 35, close game here between these two. As oh, man. This is anyone's game. And uh, a bit of a garbage reset there by Dimwit down to 39 viruses. It's now a seven virus game, folks, as it's all a big blue top line on both uh, the left and the right side for Floyd. He's really got to start working on uh, getting those blues cleared out here. What's he going to do with this double blue? Just lays it flat, tries to expose Very those nice. yellows. Smart play. But it is now uh, just a half a dozen between these two players as Dimwit trying to get a big comeback and gets close with a big T. Man, this is another gut-wrenching, hard-in-your-throat match. Floyd's going to be under 21st, but 27 viruses to go here for Dimwit as he is getting some pretty favorable RNG. He's going to get a drop cross. He's going to be down to 23, 23 to 13, now 23 to 11. Floyd's got to get those spires taken care of in columns 2 and 3 uh, as it is now 20 viruses now 19 viruses is Dimwit not going for those uh, quick clears with those double yellows. Lloyd's options are a bit limited, but now he's in an ideal spot to take care of most of what's still on his board. 5 to 11 right now. Floyd in a good position. That yellow is going to be the big problem point, but that double blue huge as it opens up that uh yellow pill so it looks like we're going to go to a game five here as floyd is going to cruise wow. to a game four victory 1303 oh. he holds dimwit off man floyd gunning for the reverse sweep and in, in his first final it is now two games to two ladies and gentlemen what a wild finish this is going to be. Two consecutive deciders. Dimwit has had to play 10 rounds of Dr. Mario almost consecutively. I got to say, I'm very happy and kind of honored that this is the first match I get to commentate on the Dr. Mario monthly. Between the one and the two seed, Floyd and Dimwit. Floyd coming back here down 0 2 has evened it up. This is it. Winner take all. There is no next game. This is it. This is for the championship. We're waiting on Dimwit. Dimwit wanting to deal with some OBS issues. 64 folks here are going to see our uh, newest Dr. Mario champion. We're just waiting on that ready from Dimwit as he is dealing with some technical issues. Looks like he's good. All right, folks, here it is. Oh. Let's go here. And isn't this great? This is for the August Championship, Packy. Whoever wins this takes it home. A fifth game here in what's just been an exciting Sunday. It went off to a pretty good start. Yeah, it has a place to put pretty much every pill. Swong wanting a level 18 sudden death. Don't do that to us. <laughs> Floyd off to... I'm over, I'm over here mumbling to myself, yes, let's do this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> do I mean, it. You and Savage are the only ones to have gone into sudden death as Floyd getting that drop horizontal at 45, but Dimwit already going to town at 37. Has a very clean board. A little bit of an issue on that right side, uh, but it looks like he's starting to address it, and uh, looks like he's waiting on a blue-red to do it with. And he's going to no, forego it and just get it off. Yep. All that garbage got cleaned out in a hurry. And his board is relatively flat. So he has so he has plenty of plays and plenty of plenty of room to work. 
35 to 23 here as we cross the minute mark for both players. Good boards for both. Uh, looks like red, though, could be a problem. A little bit of garbage dropped down in that lower section, but not that big a deal as Floyd's turned that into a nice setup and then into a combo. Bit of drop time, but uh, if you're going to get rid of those high stragglers, if you can drop a combo down, that's always good. 26, now 23 to go for Floyd, but uh, it's already a dozen viruses for Dimwit. Uh, looks like he's going to very clearly hit single digits first, but Floyd trying to open up his board here, especially that left corner packy as he wants to take this one home. Got a good sequence of pills there to clean up the up, more of the upper half of his board. He's got a quad opportunity on the far left. And it is a one virus advantage now for Dimwit, uh, who's now down to five. And it looks like he is setting up for a horizontal clear. Six to four now. Now two to six. As Dimwit looking to get out first. Floyd with a little bit of hesitation there on that end game. And a lot sometimes of when your sometimes when your controller gets a little froggy, you might want to just slow yourself down a little bit. Ooh, and a bit of a That's misplay a nice there combo. by uh, Dimwit went, but had a blue to back him up out at about two twenty. And uh, yeah. actually, Floyd in the lead right now by a few seconds. Yeah, time wise, he's still in the he's in the lead for now. Remember, these players do sometimes start a little bit uh, off the gun. And that's fine, uh, you know, as long as they start at a reasonable time. Uh, but right now, it's pretty much deadlocked here in this fifth game. A little bit of spire action on Floyd's board. A double blue would be... Oh, I just said double blue and it just appeared. Why they're doesn't gonna, this ever gonna, work for me? They're going to want you in the booth more now after this. Uh, but Floyd's, <laughs> big, Floyd's got a big problem right now. A lot of red on that top line. Uh, needs some access, needs some help uh, to start chipping at this board uh, down to 33 viruses. And he has a big lead over Dimwit, but Dimwit's starting to attack here. He's now going to be at the sub-40 range, 38 to go, uh, as he's starting to streak here. Uh, gotten <laughs> clears on, uh, looks like, five consecutive pills now, uh, down to 31 viruses here as he's going to get some favorable RNG. Not so great with that red piece, sinks it down, deals with it later. Uh, and we're going to see a drop cross here, 26 to 27. Now Dimwit has the lead uh, as Floyd trying to uh, retake it here. Big T there puts him at 20. That's the lead he's looking for. Another nice long horizontal play along the bottom puts him at 17. Now 14 for Floyd. Floyd getting some great RNG. Oh, man, he is on a run right now. He is down to seven right now. Big, big surge right now. For Floyd as he is looking to take home his first ever championship against Dimwit. Good call there. Do not waste reds because you need more of those than anything else right now. Uh, flipped a little too early there. So now he's going to have to drop something in there. And this That'll is, work perfectly. This is giving Dimwit an opportunity here, and he's setting up for a big combo of his own. But Floyd uh, out at about a 428. Double blue. Oh, there it is. Man, I'm speaking double blues into existence right now. Big, big combo there, <laughs> and Dimwit's not going to be oh. far behind. Oh, and we got a miss drop on Floyd's side. That's huge. He may have to top out. That's going to be hard to clear out. I don't think he can. He's going to have to go underneath. That or possibly horizontal, that blue. Yep, that's what he's going to do. Drop it, dropping down everything and, down. And, and now uh, he can clear it vertically. Oh, man. Uh, big, big sigh of relief. relief. <laughs> Meanwhile, Dimwit has a bit of a situation on his side, but he turns that into a combo down to 58 viruses. I think everybody holding their breath there uh, as Floyd very, very close to a top out. Uh, big, big recovery there. Uh, he is at 44 viruses and holding a 10 virus lead over the two seed. Floyd needs access to red right now. He doesn't have a whole lot, but he can do some convenient bracket clears to keep his board right. Dimwit's got a very, very messy board. This is very uncharacteristic oh, of him. He's got some really rough he, RNG. He needs red right now, like in the worst way. And he's probably going oh, for look okay, at this. that works just Great fine. Sequence. Whew. But uh another sigh of relief. 
Floyd has really opened this up, though. As he is, we are about yeah, we're about at the halfway mark of this run, and watching Floyd just storm back after losing the first two games has been outstanding. Let's see if he can finish it off. Floyd and Dimwit share this big, big strength where they just remain as stoic and focused as possible. You rarely see them get flustered. Uh, and it, it very much just very calm, cool, and collected players. And uh, Floyd really showing his stuff right now. Just absolutely, we were we, this. This was an inevitability. Seeing him get to a final, he's one of the best players in Doctor Mario. You know, you've seen him put up those great speed run times, uh, and you know, you see him come so close competitively. So seeing him in this finals, and especially holding his own, forcing a game five after being down 0-2. Great performance today. Absolutely. Floyd is too good to not make a finals. Floyd is too good. I, I right really now. do believe that. <laughs> Floyd is out of 15 at the 704 mark. Just two levels to go. Dimwit has 16 viruses to go. Can't really, just really not being able to get anything going. He's got this big cluster here. Uh, you could start working on maybe some doubles, but everything seems to be a bit jumbled as uh, Floyd cruising through 16 right now. Uh, going nice and easy. I don't know if he's aware of where Dimwit is, uh, but uh, he is definitely uh, making the most of uh, this run right now. Not a lot of access to blue, gonna have to force some drills down, uh, but still really in control here as uh, he is well into level 16. If I am Floyd right now, just keep your foot on the gas, relax, stay within yourself because you are good enough to win this thing. Don't try to do anything crazy. And another thing about medium speed is that when you start getting to the point where you're only three or four rows away from the top at the start of the level, you, when you're when yeah. you're on medium speed, you have more to you have more room to play with. Dimwit was out of fifteen at about an eight twelve here, uh, but this is a big big lead for Floyd. Uh, but you know, we've, we've seen crazy comebacks happen in these late levels. Uh, we'll see what Dimwit does. Uh, but right now it is firmly all, all about Floyd right now is look at this beautiful end game. So many doubles. Oh man, that end game looks amazing. I think everything on his board is a potential double right now. Save for that blue straggler up in row five. Yeah. He could double clear just about everything else. This is wild. Yeah. Up oh, decides to get the fat log, and he's already set up for that red horizontal. Oh, that's this is such a great end game right in here. I really would love to see what the time was on this. Is Floyd's going to be out at nine oh one? He is just Phenomenal. north of nine minutes. He could. He is torching this he is right now. In record time territory right now with how he's going, he's playing absolutely We've, brilliantly. Yeah. We have seen a lot of hot times in this series, and we're going to see another one. I get the. I've got the feeling. It's gonna be. It's got to be at an eleven forty one or less for him to get that uh, top time. But uh, the way Floyd's playing right now, the way RNG is going for him, this is phenomenal. Oh, man, I I have never seen Dimwit get this far behind before. Yeah, that that simply does not happen because Dimwit is is just that good, but Floyd is just taking it to a whole another level right now. Floyd, what can you do? <laughs> Floyd was employing the packy strategy of get mad at my losses and then storm the hell back. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. 32 viruses between Floyd and a championship here. He is just running away with this right now. He's just now at 10 minutes. He cleared half of this level out in 60 seconds, Packy. That's re for level 17. That's ridiculous. That's, that's when you go stupid. That, that's when you check the times on speedrun.com. Yeah, we're looking at a great run here uh, by Floyd. A little bit of RNG hang up, but uh, 25 viruses to go, but just an absolute bombardment of this level 17 to start. Not a lot of red access, but uh, 23 viruses to go here and a, a nice split as well here. Uh, and he's going to drill down, get access to that blue. Dim went out at a 1045, but. Uh, 50 virus lead, uh, my 50, gosh. 50 virus lead right now for Floyd as uh, he's about to hit the 11-minute mark. And, uh, again, really, really healthy board right now. I, I cannot believe how well this is going for Floyd. 
15 viruses to go here. Boom, boom. Floyd attacks that left side spire. That's smart. Come on, RNG. Let's see that record. 10 viruses to go for Floyd. Big drop there. Puts him down to eight. Floyd's got a traffic light and a two by two. And I cannot believe this. This this could very well be a reality, folks. Look at this. He's going to get the quad. He's going to get set up for that blue. He's got that red hanging. On, oh, my goodness. Smart. Seven. Eight. He's going to be... Oh, he's going he to tie gonna it. tie the record and take home the championship. Floyd 1977, your August champion. What a comeback. Wow, man, that's oh, wow. An amazing run by Floyd, uh, uh, tying the all-time finals record. What a run. And we'll be talking with Floyd and Dimwit here in a second. Dimwit just applauding. He knows it's been over. A reverse sweep from Floyd. See if we can get our players in here just for a quick little chat. Woo. This has just been a uh, christening here for Floyd. Uh, as yeah. this is, we've all wanted to see this, I think, for a while. Floyd's such a talented player. And we've got Dimwit in here. We'll see if we can get Floyd in here. Dimwit, uh, Floyd just ran away from you. Man, he was on fire. What a great job he did. Uh, like, I felt like I was doing fairly well, but I kept hearing in my ear, oh, Dimwit's 30 behind, 40 behind, 50 behind. Oh, my God. What a monster. Well done. Reverse sweep. Well, you know, I take off the headphones when I'm playing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you throw them. Yeah, I, I mean, this was great. I, I had a ton of fun. I'm so pleased with the outcome. The reverse sweep makes it so exciting to watch. We had uh, two games uh, in the last two matches where the decision was one second apart. I mean, what more can you want from a tournament? Absolutely awesome. We're trying to get Floyd into here. Come on in, champ. There he is. Let's get him in here. Oh, he opted out. Okay. Well, why don't we try to get Floyd back in here? Uh, reminder that uh, our... Uh, oh, here's Floyd again. Let's try this one more time. There he is. There's our champion, hey. Floyd. How are you? Wow, congratulations. congratulations again. Outstanding, Thanks, guys. Man. I did not... I did not anticipate it going that way. I was tell, I did not think I'd get a sub twelve. I cannot believe. Tell it. Tell yeah. us what was going through your mind uh, going into game three, being down o two, because that's never a good position to be in. I just, I don't know. Like looking at Dimwit's times, I thought I actually had a chance today. I mean, I, but his first two times were just phenomenal, and I, I thought I could just win a game, you know. And I don't know, like. I don't, know. I don't know how that happened <laughs> but like ever since i ever since i joined this it's been dim went and packy and i've looked up to them and it's just crazy i can't believe it and i mean you do a phenomenal amount of work as well behind the scenes uh getting our website put together and looking nice uh the, the, this i really felt was an inevitability you're one of our best players you've been putting up amazing uh zero ten and zero twenty times uh it was really nice to see it all come together here for you this afternoon congratulations Thank you very much. Thanks, Dimwit. Good job. Yeah, now Packy and I look up to you. That's right. <laughs> right. I, I thought it, you said it. <laughs> well, Floyd's got a little bit of time to uh, celebrate, but uh, possibly uh, has a chance to defend that title as we start our September speedrun tournament immediately following this stream. You will not want to miss out on that. Uh, but I want to give a big thank you to everybody who helped me in the booth. Larva, uh, Dimwit, Packy, 
uh, Chris Bidwell, uh, and anybody else I missed, I do apologize. Uh, congratulations to Floyd, commiserations to Dimwit, and a big thank you as always to all of you, 69 of you. That's a very nice number of you watching uh, yes. this stream. <laughs> And uh, we hope to see you again very, very soon. Our next stream is going to be this coming Friday where we do uh, our live qualifiers. You can see these players put up these big scores, uh, make big 30-minute runs. You will not want to miss out on that. Until then, my name's JB Henry. Thank you so much for joining us this weekend. Remember to be kind, and we will see you again very, very soon. Take care, everybody. Have a good night.